Good morning, you guys. Um, coming at you fresh faced. Just my skincare. I just washed my face, put everything on, and I'm going to show you what I do with makeup just for a quick kind of everyday. I actually, every day, I don't really wear makeup. I try not to because my skin is so sensitive. But if we're taking some pictures or anything like that and I just want to put a little bit on, um, this is what I do. Starting with our favorite, Luna and Aster CC Cream. It's the summer, and so I want to have, um, I usually have a little bit more color. So I mix a little bit of the medium with a little bit of the light on the top of my hand. Not much, just like that much. Because I just did my skincare, um, I'm not going to mix it with moisturizer. But um, if some of you think it's too thick, then definitely mix it with moisturizer. I like to do it right after I put my skincare on so that my skin is very moisturized and the Luna and Aster just goes right on. Um, I love it because it just evens everything out while it still looks like your skin and it gives you an awesome glow. It's not mattifying, um, it just kind of makes you makes your skin look healthy which i love okay favorite brush ever ever forever 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 love it gotta make sure you blend 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 i bounce between two concealers um i have been using this one as you can i mean this is like my 12th bottle i've bought this stuff is like wearing off um i have very sensitive skin yes i um have been using certain products that are not clean. Primarily, I would say, just like how I eat, 80-20 clean, I try to do my skincare and my makeup about 80-20. Most of it is clean. This is not, but my I've been using it for so long that um, I know it's not gonna bother my skin. So, by the way, I'm tagging everything for you guys. I've got to look and see exactly. It's some eraser deal. I don't know. Drugstore. Love me a good drugstore find. And by the way, this brush, which I will link, is incredible. So I use the smaller side for concealer. And I usually mostly put concealer on my lids. Just a little bit under my eyes. That's it. Okay. Now I want to take this side of the brush. I'm going to do a little bit of translucent powder on my lid just to set that concealer. Just so it doesn't get that like, you know how you can get it all like when you get hot or something, it kind of gets all in the crease. This translucent powder kind of helps that. And then if there's any spots that just feel like a little too much glow. There's a difference between glow and shiny. So I kind of hit a couple spots with that translucent powder. I've been using this also for like 10 plus years. These are our favorite um, eyeshadow. This is not very easy to do. <laughs> not in a mirror, but you guys will, like how easy is that? Done. I will link the color. I love this color. It just is a nice little pop. Now, if I was going out at night, I might do take this same one and go like right under my eyes as well, but I don't wanna do that just for like a day. There you go, that's it. Eyebrows. As you know, I have been using the Revitalash on my eyebrows. Definitely has filled them in and made them a little darker. So, Really, I don't need to do much, but I like to kind of shape them. I got this as a gift and I've been liking it. It doesn't really add much color because my color's already there. This just kind of makes sure everything stays in place. I kind of really like, I've been really enjoying this. So eyebrows, check. I love to look like I have a little bit of color. Not too much. So I do top of my forehead. It's like that three. You go dink, dink, and chin. Right here, right here, chin. I've been wearing this bronzer for, again, 
10 plus years. I go down the nose and then I do a quick like that. Okay, now I got a little color. And I love blush. Love it, love it, love it. Love having colors on my cheeks. Here's just a really pretty pink. This is about the easiest blush. Using these cream blushes is so easy. You can't really mess up. So there you go. I take my same brush with some foundation still left on it and just make sure, just give it a couple swipes. Love that color. It's really pretty. So I have been using Thrive Mascara. It is a silicone tubular mascara. It's great. Um, super dark, goes on really fast, really easy. And it is perfect for every day. And then it comes right off at night just with water. Love mascara. Okay, last but not least, my little Jones Road in O Natural right on my cheekbones. Again, you just take that same brush, blend it in, and then I need my Katie on my lips. Hold on. If you've been here, you know Katie has been my ride or die for like 10 years. The best. Okay, guys. So that's it. Laura just walked in. Super quick, super easy. I'll link all the products for you right here. And if you have any questions, send me a DM.